Joan Elaine Argetzinger Stites born January 26, 1941, is Sterling Professor of Molecular Biophysics and Biochemistry at Yale University and investigator at the Howard Hughes Medical Institute. She is known for her discoveries involving RNA, including groundbreaking insights into how ribosomes interact with messenger RNA by complementary base pairing and that introns are spliced by small nuclear ribonucleic proteins SNRNPs, which occur in eukaryotes. September, 2018, Stites won the Lasker Koshland Award for Special Achievement in Medical Science. The Lasker Award is often referred to as the American Nobel because 87 of the former recipients have gone on to win Nobel Prizes. <laughs> Early life and education Stites was born in Minneapolis, Minnesota. She grew up in Minnesota in the 1950s and 60s at a time when there were no female role models in molecular biology. She attended the then all-girls Northrop College for high school. In 1963, Stites received her Bachelor of Science degree in Chemistry from Antioch College, Ohio, where she first became interested in molecular biology at Alex Rich's Massachusetts Institute of Technology Laboratory as an Antioch Coop intern. After completing her undergraduate degree, Stites applied to medical school rather than graduate school since she knew of female medical doctors but not women scientists. She was accepted to Harvard Medical School, but having been excited by a summer working as a bench scientist in the laboratory of Joseph Gall at the University of Minnesota, she declined the invitation to Harvard Medical School and instead applied to Harvard's new program in biochemistry and molecular biology. There, she was the first female graduate student to join the laboratory of Nobel laureate James Watson, with whom she first worked on bacteriophage RNA. Career Stites completed postdoctoral research at the Medical Research Council Laboratory of Molecular Biology at the University of Cambridge UK, where she collaborated with Francis Crick, Sidney Brenner, and Mark Brecher. At the LMB, Stites focused on the question of how bacteria know where to start the «reading frame» on mRNA. In the process, Stites discovered the exact sequences on a mature RNA virus encoding three proteins where the virus mRNA binds bacterial ribosomes to produce proteins. In 1969, she published a seminal paper in Nature showing the nucleotide sequence of the binding start points. In 1970, Stites joined the faculty at Yale. In 1975, she published a research finding for which she is widely known demonstrating that ribosomes use complementary base pairing to identify the start site on mRNA. In 1980, Stites in collaboration with Michael Lerner published another critical paper, using immunoprecipitation with human antibodies from patients with autoimmunity to isolate and identify the novel entities SNRNPs pronounced SNRPs and detect their role in splicing. A SNRNP is a specific short length of RNA, around 150 nucleotides long, associated with protein, that is involved in splicing introns out of newly transcribed RNA pre-mRNA, a component of the spliceosomes. Stites's paper, "...set the field ahead by light years and heralded the avalanche of small RNAs that have since been discovered to play a role in multiple steps in RNA biosynthesis." Noted Susan Burgett, Stites later discovered another kind of SNRNP particle, the SNORN, involved in an important minority of mRNA splicing reactions. Via analysis of the genetic locations of the genes for SNORN, she demonstrated conclusively that introns are not junk DNA, as they had often been described. Her work helps explain the phenomenon of alternative RNA splicing. Quote, her discovery of the SNRNPs and SNORN explains a mysterious finding – humans have only doubled the number of genes of a fruit fly. The reason we can get away with so few genes is that when you have these bits of nonsense, you can splice them out in different ways, she said. Sometimes you can get rid of things and add things because of this splicing process so that each gene has slightly different protein products that can do slightly different things. 
so it multiplies up the information content in each of our genes. Stites's research may yield new insights into the diagnosis and treatment of autoimmune disorders such as lupus, which develop when patients make antinuclear antibodies against their own DNA, SNRNPs, or ribosomes. Stites has commented on the sexist treatment of women in science, noting that a woman scientist needs to be twice as good for half the pay. She has been a tireless promoter of women in science, noted Christine Guthrie, who described Stites as one of the greatest scientists of our generation. Stites has served in numerous professional capacities, including as scientific director of the Jane Coffin Childs Memorial Fund for Medical Research (1991–2002) and as editorial board member of Genes and Development. Topic: Personal life. Stites, born Joan Argetzinger, married Thomas Stites, also Sterling Professor of Molecular Biophysics and Biochemistry at Yale and the 2009 Nobel Prize in Chemistry laureate, in 1966. They have one son, John. Topic: Awards and honors. Lasker Koshland Award for Special Achievement in Medical Science, 2018; Royal Society of London, 2014; Biochemical Society Jubilee Lecture Award, 2009; Columbia University Honorary Doctorate of Science, 2011; Albany Medical Center Prize, shared with Elizabeth Blackburn, 2008; Rosalind E. Franklin Award for Women in Science, National Cancer Institute, 2006; Gardner Foundation International Award, 2006; E. B. Wilson Medal, 2005, American Society for Cell Biology RNA Society Lifetime Achievement Award, 2004, The Caledonian Research Foundation CRF Prize Lectureship in Biomedical Sciences and Arts and Letters, 2004, Royal Society of Edinburgh FASEB Excellence in Science Award, 2003, Louis S. Rosenstiel Award for Distinguished Basic Medical Science, 2002, L'Oréal UNESCO Award for Women in Science, 2001, Warren Biennial Prize 1989, Dixon Prize for Science 1988, National Medal of Science 1986, National Science Foundation member, National Academy of Sciences 1983, Lee Howley Sr. Award for Arthritis Research 1983, NAS Award in Molecular Biology 1982, American Academy of Arts and Sciences 1982, Eli Lilly Award in Biological Chemistry 1976 Fasano Foundation Young Scientist Award 1975 Her nomination for the Royal Society reads Topic References Topic Further reading RNA Expert Wins American Nobel Scientific American, September 11, 2018 Tanya Talaga, "...her work may lead to progress in diseases like lupus." Toronto Star Ontario ed., October 26, 2006, p. a. 10. Stites, "...the importance of role models to girls' educational choices." April 6, 2006, L'Oréal Agora, available at https colon slash slash web dot archive dot org slash web slash two zero zero seven zero three one five zero one one two one seven slash http colon slash slash dot agora dot four women in science dot com slash education underscore of underscore girls underscore and underscore women slash two zero zero six slash zero four slash the underscore importance underscore of underscore role underscore Models.php. Ilga Wasserman, The Door in the Dream: Conversations with Eminent Women in Science. Joseph Henry Press, Washington, D.C., 2000, pp. 144 to 150. RNA Interviews, Dr. Joan Stites. Ambient Technotes v. 10 n. 1 March 2003 available at https colon slash slash web dot archive dot org slash web slash two zero zero six one zero one eight one six twenty thirty three slash http colon slash slash ww dot ambien dot com slash techlib slash t n slash one oh one slash five dot html